Hello YouTube and welcome to our video number 10 in our HTML SS CSS tutorial for beginner series. And this video we are going to add multiple images to our web, web page and we are going to see how we can manipulate them. So what I did before this video I actually downloaded another image but this one with the Firefox logo and now we have a Google logo and what I want to do is I want to add both of those images to our website and see how we can manipulate them so one let's say is Google and let's close it out and here we copy this and paste that and this one let's say we'll do the Firefox one okay so now we have added two images to our website so we save this look at the preview and here we have two images right uh, pretty boring pretty you we already covered that but let's say images have thing called attributes so if I would want I could add the height of an image like this and let's say I want this one to be 800 pixels and this one I would want to be 60 pixels so this is what I would do I would write height and 800 and height and 60 so let's save this and let's look at our preview and we can see that Google is massive and Firefox is right over here um, there's many cases probably why you would want to do that uh, but now you know that it's possible in the same way you can if you have for example downloaded something a huge image which is I wouldn't suggest doing that by resizing and I would actually go to something like Photoshop and actually recrop the image but let's say you have this case where you have to do it then this is the case to do it however remember that that it doesn't even if you resize it both of them to 60 it doesn't mean that uh, web, that the uh, website is going to run faster just because they resized it 60 the browser is still going to accept the initial whatever you downloaded the size that you have downloaded the image from and then resize it for the viewer to see thank you guys for watching i'll see you at the next video